Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. Today we are doing this crazy eye look today. It's just full of matte colours. I'll be showing you some blending techniques, how to make these eyeshadows pop. So if you are interested in seeing how I did this look, then please keep watching. It is so bright in here. So as you would have seen in my last video I have taken away my backdrop but I'm going to get it back so it didn't last very long but doesn't matter okay so I'm going to use the circus tent palette today now I've already reviewed this on my youtube channel but I only used like a few colors in it so I'm going to use lots of colors today and I'm very excited about it. I've not like filmed in quite some time. Well, it feels like it's not been, it feels like it's been ages because the days are going so slow, but I just want to apologize now in case I keep looking at the viewfinder, not the camera. I'm sure I will get back into the swing of things because I've just been so lazy. So I'm starting off by priming my eyes, of course, with the Peelies bases, and this is in two and three or two and three and I'm just mixing these together just so I get a more medium shade and then I'm applying this underneath the brows and patting it all along my eye making sure that it's all nice and covered and I'm using a Morphe M224 brush so now going into the circus tint I'm going to start with the color chaos here and this is the darkest blue in the palette and with a Morphe brush, I can't remember what this is called, I'm just applying this to the outer corner of my eye and smoking it up a little bit. And then I'm just softening out those edges with a Molly O'Brien M08 brush. I'm now going into Juggle here and this is a nice sort of turquoise colour. And with a Morphe M456 brush, I'm just smoking that out and building it into that colour, making sure that it's all nice and blended together. And then I'm just darkening back up that dark blue, which is the colour Chaos again. I'm now going into Take A Bow here, and this is a really dark purple colour. I also feel like the lighting today is pretty crap. Like, it look, the lighting in person looks really good, but on the camera it's not picking up very well. And I'm using a Morphe M506, and I'm just starting to build this colour next to the blue, and going a wee bit further into the eye. I'm now going into Trapeze here, which is a nice lilac -y kind of purple and I'm using a Morphe M514 brush I'm just going to be applying this above the purple that we've done blends it into that light blue I'm now going into Bloody Mary and this is a nice dark red in the palette and with a Morphe M507 brush I'm now just building this colour up next to the purple that we had in making sure that they keep that shape really small as well now we're going into tint here which is like a good mix between a red and an orange and again I'm just applying that on top of the colour that we have on just now so this is going on top of the red and I'm using another Morphe M456 brush and I'm now going into animal here and this is probably the darkest orange in the palette I would say the one that we used before which was tint is a wee bit darker but I've already used that above the red here and I want to use as many colours as we can so I'm going to go in with animal now and I'm using another Morphe M506 brush and I'm applying this next to the red again going a wee bit further into the eye I'm now going in with Giggles Up here and this is a lighter orange this time and with an Egg Shot blending brush I'm just applying that a little bit higher than the orange that we have on already I'm now going into Cirque here with another Morphe M506 brush and again I'm just applying that next to the orange that we already have in and then I'm going in to Bananas and for the last time I'm just going a little bit higher than that colour again and I'm using a Lick and Lash brush for this I've just decided to go into Top Hat here and I'm going to darken that outer corner because the purple that we used is darker than the blue so I don't want it to go from light to dark and then to lighter again so it's just not going to look right and then I'm just going to go back and forward and make sure that these are all blended together because they're looking a little bit rough at the moment 
Okay, I'm now going to go and do the other eye off camera. I've never actually done it like this before. I always do two eyes at the same time, but I'm trying to make my life a little bit easier when I'm editing. So I'm going to do the other eye now, and then I'm going to do my base, and then I will come back for the rest of the look. I'm now going to do some eyeliner, and this is the Bobbi Brown Gel Liner in Black Ink, and this is my favourite eyeliner ever. I swear by it, and I definitely recommend it. And I'm going in with the Morphe M250-1 brush. And I'm just lining my eye with this, making sure that I'm starting really thin to the inner corner of my eye and then getting thicker as I go out. I'm now going to mix together these two liners from Sheen. Now these are water activated paints so you just need to be really careful when you're putting these in your eye. And I'm a little bit concerned for my eyeballs but I really want a mix of these colours so we're just going to have to do it. Okay, so that never works. We're going to need to regroup. I'm just going to mix together this Hint of Mint Peelouise base with the Rewipe paint and apply that into my lash line instead. I'm now going to apply my Lou Lashes in Style Honey and apply some mascara and then I'll be right back. And this is the finished look. Thank you so much for watching this video. If you made it to the end, can you please leave me an eye emoji in the comments and also give this video a big thumbs up and subscribe down below if you would like to see more please feel free to hit the notification bell if you don't want to miss another upload this is my first makeup look that i filmed in a long time so please let me know if you like this content this is what i originally started with but i feel like i've kind of went off into other things I've done a few vlogs and stuff but i'd love to know what your favorite kind of video is to watch and i hope to see you in the next one bye 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 bye, bye.